Looking at overtime. Whoa. What's going on, people? That's like blurry, right? I'm coming up. You know, I hit the floor. You freaking man. Well, there you are. What's up, guys? Steven. Steven Graham. Konaman. Hi, Ridge. What's up, Hi, Ridge Handyman? You know, I meant to hit you up, Hi, Ridge. Hi, uh, Hi Ridge Handyman's got a slamming Instagram page going. Ernie Adam, what's up, buddy? No, no Rona yet, Ernie. Sin N, HL, Super Nick. All right, guys, this is something new. And uh, for the patrons, I'm so sorry. I, I, I dropped the ball. I literally forgot last night. So we'll do it tonight. All of a sudden, it was like 10, 10 12. And I'm like, oh, I forgot to do the freaking. And I was all ready. At like six oh. I was like, yeah, you know, we'll give it another like hour, hour and a half. And um, London Real just got shut down. Oh, no. Steven Vladimov. What's up, buddy? Steve, what's up? Thank you. I, I, I got your message, too, on Instagram. That was very nice of you, Steve. All right. So, guys, this is the brand new. Bosch six piece professional screwdriver set. All right. Now, for $21, we're going to see. But spec wise, I don't know if you're going to beat uh, this screwdriver set, especially if you're in the Bosch platform, because this comes with something that you hear me talk about all the time with Milwaukee that Milwaukee should start doing this instead of these dopey bags. Or what they should do is give you a bag, but with an insert inside the bag. You know, they're flat bags on the bottom. Just, you know, stick an insert on the bottom of the bag. But what you're going to get here, guys, is a lot of great features. You always hear me talk about certain features of the screwdriver that I really like. We're not, though. Patrick is. Um, what's up? Yeah. <laughs> Joseph, what's up, buddy? Live, live, live. Yes, and, and I missed you, man. It's been a while for sure. But what you get with these um, screwdrivers, I think you get a lot of value, again, for the price. And again, I'm going to show you. It has a couple really cool things. Um, let me, I'm shutting off my thing. Thank you. We don't want beeps. Robert. Thank you, Robert. Robert Bates is in the house. I appreciate that, buddy. Steven Cruz, what's up, man? All right, so again, this is the uh, six-piece screwdriver set. Now, you're going to get Phillips and flatheads. Everything's going to be labeled on the screwdriver uh, handle and on the actual blade, okay? Now, you got a go-through blade, all right? So, again... For the price, guys, this is a very heavy-duty set of screwdrivers. Like I said, I'm going to show you once I open them. But you got a go-through blade, all right? So that blade's going all the way right to the top of the handle, pretty much. All right? A lot of them stop, you know, right at the end of the handle, pretty much. But this is going all the way through, all right? Extra support, extra stability. You got the hexagon bolster, all right? You always hear me talk about the hex bolster. Excellent, not only for support, but, you know, if you got to get a wrench. Um, it's ergonomic, and it has the anti-roll feature, all right? Just like our DeWalt anti-roll, and what's cool about it is what you just heard me say. John Rice, what's up, buddy? Thank you, Tony. Ernie, so, yeah, L-Box ready. So that's what I'm talking about, all right? You know, wouldn't it be great if you're Milwaukee stubby that you just ordered from uh, uh ohio power tool you know comes with a nice bag but on the bottom of the bag it's got a, a nice insert right so if you want to put it in one of their pack out boxes now bosch really does a great job 
Um, a lot of their tools they offer with these, um, you know, uh, these little inserts, so you can put them right in the L box. All right. Now they have made some improvements, and it's been a year. And I told myself I was going to get one of the new improved L boxes. I just haven't done it yet. Um, but they have improved them a little bit. But it's a it's a decent box, guys. You know the Fest Tool, the Makita. They're all basically the same. Um, you know, they're a little high priced only because obviously you can get the pack out for, you know, pretty much the same price. But we went over everything here, guys. Again, um, durable tip and these are magnetic as well, but um, they are CRV. All right. So chrome vanadium and that's, you know, pretty much top of the line with screwdrivers. You don't really see the Molly screwdrivers. Um but, and here's all the sizes, you know, slotted, four and a half, 100 millimeter, three and a half, 75. The six and a half is 125. And you get two Phillips, a Phillips number two and a Phillips number one. And the Phillips number two is 125 and the Phillips number one is 100. All right. So, like I said, whoa, what's going on? All right. Um, that's a real nice setup for a screwdriver set. You know, they give you a nice little box here. Um, again, for $21. Now, that was on Amazon. That's the only place I could find this. All right. You might be able to get it cheaper somewhere else. I don't know. $21.99 seemed like a... I put the link below. But presently, they're sold out, it looks like. But you can keep checking, I guess. Um, yeah. And it's an original. You see that? It's a Bosch original. Man, the lighting's terrible in here. All right, just turn the little, see, Bosch original. It's like a feature film here. It's an original feature presentation. This thing's locked up like Fort Knox over here. Like a Fort Knox, and baby. Look at this. All right. Wow. Nice. All right. Very nice. That's very nice. All right. So you get this nice uh, insert, like I said. So you're rocking with the L box. Um, you know, you're pretty much ready to go. You can slide this insert right into your L box. But what's also great about it, guys? Again, you got a tool cart. You got a, you know, chest cabinet combo. Or you just got the the cabinet. You got a nice couple of drawers there. Patrick, thank you. Thank you so much, Patrick. I hope you're doing good. Not necessary, Patrick. You, I appreciate it. John Spitzley. Yeah, real nice. All right. So, again, uh, appreciate that, guys. Um, you know, right into your tool cart. Um, you know, workstation, workbench, you know, chest cabinet combo, but really nice design for the L box. So we'll check that out in a second. But what I like about these, and they don't, they didn't put it, you know, they told us it was anti roll, all this nice stuff, but they didn't tell you about probably the best feature. You got a metal end cap. Okay. So. Chip shot. What's up, buddy? Long time no see. Oh, oh, it does tell you. My bad. I didn't really look at it. But yeah, metal end cap. And actually on here, they, they tell you pretty much everything you got going. So durable tip. Hex bolster. That's your anti-roll. Here's your blade going all the way through to the handle. And you got your nice ergonomic grip. And at the end, you got your metal end cap so thank you chip shot christopher cavetti what's up jt so again really nice so again you got that nice blade through all right going right through the handle and these are really nice guys i love the grip on these all right so you got this nice rubber over mold all right then you got plastic and on the plastic is the uh id number or the model number all right and like i said you got the actual screwdriver, Phillips number one, written on the plastic of the anti-roll. 
And it's also, oh no, that's, um, I thought they had it listed on the blade as well. But on the blade, you have it, it's, you probably can't see it. It just tells you that it's chrome vanadium. But you got that nice tip. Let's see. I had some screws. Where are my screws, dude? I just had them. Well, I just had some. But yeah, real nice. So you got that end cap. So again, you're doing some heavy duty work. You got to kind of bang this with a handle, uh, with, with like a hammer or a mallet. You'll be good to go uh, with the screwdriver. You don't have to worry about it cracking or anything. You know, hitting plastic. I just had a whole bunch of screw, freaking little screws. You son of... I'm just going to really lose it here. Oh. Well, I can't believe... I got that, and I'll use our perch. Our perch. Yeah, the guy from Perch hit me up. Uh, you guys really love that stuff. Uh, he woke up this morning with a whole bunch of orders. He was very, very happy, and I was happy to help him out. Seems like a nice guy. So, um, But anyway, here's your, um, your screwdriver. This is obviously your Phillips. Uh, number one here again 100 millimeter all right so you got that nice so you got the nice bosch raised logo here just a very nice well done screwdriver got the hex bolster all right you kind of compare it you know let me just grab a phillips number one all right here's a wearer number one now this set was 21.99 this set is probably 35 dollars all right, I mean, and it's it's Wera, but I can tell you, again, definitely you probably don't have no blade through going all the way through the handle with this one. Now they do make uh, more heavy duty screwdrivers than this, but this isn't this is isn't a cheap screwdriver set. Um, you know, you got that, you know, patented Wera handle here, and you got these rubber overmolds. But you know, you got your anti roll, you got your anti roll here. All right. You got your model, you know, label and model number here and what screwdriver it is. Obviously, Phillips and then your model number. Really, same thing on this is that you kind of have it right on the anti-roll. And then you kind of have the other right here. But a much more comfortable, again, I wasn't a big fan of the wearer grips. If you've been following me, again, I think where Weha. If you're really looking for that top of the line screwdriver, I mean, this thing weighs so much more too. This weighs, <laughs> I would say double of what the Wera weighs. All right. Now, obviously you got a hex bolster. It's a little bit longer. I wouldn't say a little bit. This is probably 75 millimeters compared to the Bosch. That's a hundred. But again, I really like the grip on this. Now, the problem with this, and I, you know, have small hands. You guys always hear me talk about that. You know, this is way too small of a handle, if you want my opinion. This, beautiful. All right. Um, you know, the blade is real. I mean, again, for the price, and obviously you don't get a metal end cap with your wearer here. But again, this is probably like a $35, $40 set. Um and these aren't really the best made. I mean, I can easily bend this if I wanted to. If I wanted to destroy my Wera screwdriver here, I can, yeah, I can do it. I can do it. I know I can do it. Um, that's definitely not happening with this Bosch here. All right. Um, you know, obviously this is a Phillips number two here, but I'll get the Phillips number two. Where's the big boy? All right, and this is 125. Wow, this thing is, they're heavy. All right, this is a uh, a pretty heavy screwdriver. Wow. Um, I would, again, say probably double the weight of my wearers here. And here is, you know, again, just to show you the the difference in in length here. All right.
Again, this is probably 100. This is 125. But again, the weight difference is, <laughs> you know, it's double. And it might be even more than double. All right, now obviously you got the bolster, you got the metal end cap, and you got the blade going all the way through to the handle here. So, and you know, what I'm trying to get through to you here is, I'm not even going to tell you it's a better screwdriver than the wearer, but value-wise, again, $21.99 versus the $35 set, all right? And you don't get the bolster, all right? You don't get the blade through, um, the blade through handle going all the way through the handle, and you definitely don't get the metal yet. I'll be honest with you. The Weeha set with the uh, metal end cap, their heavy-duty set, they're beasts. You always hear me talk about that. They're actually on my Milwaukee um, tool cart. They're, they're beasts, but that set is like 85 bucks. All right? You're talking about a $21 set here. All right? Really, really nice, guys. Um, super impressed. You kind of just feel the quality. You know, with those heart screwdrivers, I think that was the last set. You know, they were just so light. And again, guys, that was a $14 um, you know, screwdriver set. But again, $21.99. And again, with the heart, you're definitely not getting a metal end cap and a hex bolster. So to spend an extra $7, but really, really nice. In my opinion, guys... I don't think you'll find a better screwdriver set in the market for the money. No doubt about it. All right. These aren't magnetic. So that's another plus. Some people like magnetic. Some people don't. But these are not magnetic. But um, really nice. I just, I, I like the grip too. All right. Here's your, I mean, I mean this little suckers. You know, we're going to have to do it. Just because, let me forget the scale. Where's the scale? You gotta be kidding me, you. Someone took my freaking scale and gonna kill me. And then why would somebody touch my scale? Why would somebody touch my scale? was sitting up here so freaking pretty it was so so pretty and not for nothing guys real quick uh your dewalt set that you always hear me talk about waste of money for 20 20 bucks these blow those dewalts away again just real chintzy really cheap um if you have those DeWalt, you know, Home Depot screwdrivers, again, they make different models, but the one that you're going to find at Depot, where the hell is my scale? I don't understand why my scale is. Well, you're going to have to trust me, folks. But these are definitely, um, I like the weight of them. I hate the ones that are really super light and cheap and, you know, really thin blade that you can kind of bend. Um, again, for the money, this is really nice. Let's go. What's up, 94? 94, I'll check you tonight. And again, you got that nice raised Bosch logo on it. You know, like I said, guys, I can, you know, talk about them till the cows come home. But I think for the features that you get, you know, you heard me say I'm around, you know, 10 times. But um nice. Yeah, $21. Oh, great. Guys, Boris Johnson has moved to the intensive care unit. I can't believe that the leader of a country is gonna die from this. It's unbelievable. He just passed Brexit. All right, so again, guys, you get some really good features here for the money. Um, I, I love them. I love the grip. You know, they're not really small. Again, you got the overmold here with this nice little hex pattern on it. Really small. You probably can't see it. All right. But you got that nice anti-roll feature, right? All right. It'll kind of stop itself before it kind of rolls off your table. All right. And again, the heavier... The screwdriver, the better that anti-roll works. 
because this one's not really moving at all. This one's a little bit lighter. But again, you got the blade going all the way through to the to the end of the handle. You got that nice metal end cap. So if you got to slam this thing um, with a hammer, I mean, just a real nice heavy duty set. You got your bolster. Again, you know, is it like the Wera heavy duties or the Weha heavy duties? No, but you're paying twenty one dollars. Okay, so, but I I don't know. I would put it right up there with them. Now here comes the cool part with these screwdrivers, guys. And I'll do a better video with these. Um, actually, I might even be able to, to do one. But yeah, we'll do one. I'll screw one into a piece of wood for you. People seem to like that. All right, so here is another great feature. Again, $21. Uh, if you're in their L-Box platform, if you're a Bosch man, you might be rocking with an L-Box. All right. You get this nice insert. So we're ready to rock with any L box. Let me just move it up. All right. So you got your L box. All right. Real nice. That's very nice. And it even has the grooves. You see? Right here, you have. This slotted out area, that's for you to put on either side. We'll put it on this side, right? Oh, yeah. So sweet. Now, if you have other inserts, say you have your impact driver and your, or your impact wrench or anything like that, this will sit right on top of it. All right? So if you kind of want to get to this, you know, you just got to kind of have to take this off. Then you got your impact. Or you could do it vice versa. Obviously, you can keep this on the bottom. Um, you know, just a great, for $21, it's crazy. All right, now, I don't know if that, I, that seems a little weird to me. I, I Just knowing Bosch, and you guys who, who are into Bosch, you know, they're not really cheap. And again, uh, that might have been some kind of sale price or something. But um, I love them. I, I just love the feel of them. Um, but again, for what features you get, you have to ask yourself, is it worth going to Home Depot and getting a Milwaukee set where you get, you know, six screwdrivers for 30 bucks? All right. Pretty much the same six that you're going to get with this Bosch set. Not only is this set $10 cheaper, you got the bolster, you got the end cap. Um, I don't think the Milwaukee's uh, blade goes all the way through to the handle, but I don't have Milwaukee screwdrivers. I don't know. But, um, Let's No, I don't have Oh, I guess this would work. I'm coming up. I think I hate the floor. It's such a piece. I like yeah, I do. I think this is a, you know, I had to, these just came in and I'm like, I got, I'm doing this video right now because I was pretty impressed. Um, you know, guys, it's all about the value here. I really, you know, I do deals. That's the big thing you guys. And it's about getting, you know, the best bang for your buck. And again, for this price, I don't think you're going to find a better screwdriver set out there. You know, for, you know, I mentioned the heart, right? I think the heart is an eight piece though. I think the heart is an eight piece screwdriver set. And it's like $15.99. But again, this is just so much better. Such a better set. But the hearts, not bad. I don't, you know, don't get me wrong. I think they're they're pretty decent, the hearts. But, you know, let's not be crazy. All right, I'm trying to set this up here. Give me one second. Yeah, they're not bad here. I'll let you take a nice closer look here they're very nice whoa
It's too dark. There we go. Nice and bright. The handle doesn't look big, maybe through looking at this. But this is just the Phillips number one, by the way. But the handle is very, it's it's nice. And it's not too big, but it's big. And I like it. It's comfortable. Gives you some, you know, those little handles. I don't know, good. And you got that double sport grip, the, the rubber overmold there. Yeah, $20, $21. It's a no-brainer. Yeah, and if you want magnetic, you know, again, that's um, these are not magnetic, but a lot of them aren't these days, to be honest with you. I'm coming up. All right, let me just get this. I think I got it, boy. Oh, wow. 40. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Give me a second, guys. All right, so here's your Phillips number two. Again, a very heavy uh, screwdriver. That's what I want you to kind of get through this because, I, you know, obviously you can see the end cap. You know, you see the nice rubber over molds on the handle. You see the hex bolster. But very heavy, and they feel very well made. And I bought these guys, so... You know, it ain't like Bosch sent these to me or anything. I don't work with Bosch at all. That's why I don't really feature them that much because their stuff's really expensive. All right, so. All right, here's the uh, perch little screw. But fits real nice. And again, this is a pretty big little screw. It's not long, but it's wide. And it's just... Real nice and sweet there. Beautiful. It does what it's supposed to do. All right. So, yeah, guys, $21.99. Um, they're sold out at the moment. I'll keep my eye out for them. But I don't think you're going to find a better set of screwdrivers for the price. It really has everything. And these are the professional. All right. So, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know if I got lucky. I just can't see these being $21. Um, and here's that nice chrome vanadium um, slotted 6.5, 125. So we'll put that up to the other 125. And then I can show you the nice... Running out of room, you freak. Running. All right. So, real nice set here. Let me zoom out. All right. The only one that doesn't have a hex bolster is the smallest, and you don't get a metal end cap. But the other five, you get end caps. Obviously, you don't want to be hitting a, you know, little... 3.5 times 7.5 screwdriver with a hammer but remember the blade still goes all the way through this all right but you know it doesn't have a metal end cap or a bolster so without having a bolster you kind of see just you know the dewalts are really bad these these wearers aren't too bad without you know you can kind of tell it's it's a you know a decent little screwdriver but you know, here you kind of have that double uh, plastic, kind of like a little insert here too, which helps. But, and there's your model number. But here is your nice little insert. And again, everything fits perfect. snaps right in snaps right in dude yeah yeah I messed up somewhere but now we got it but now we got it 
All right. Nice little feature, guys. It's a feature rich screwdriver set. All right. Now, obviously, you can fit this in your tough system or your Milwaukee pack out, I'm sure. Um, but like I said, even if you have a tool car or a chest cabinet combo, you can slide this right into the drawer. You don't got to worry about your screwdrivers kind of, you know, running away on you. And you do got the anti-roll feature, but not bad. I think it's a great set for the money, guys. That's why I bought it. And I featured it here. And again, if you have some of the other... Yeah, actually, by the way, here's another insert. Like, boom. All right. So this one is kind of, you know, for, your, for the charger and the batteries, I believe. All right. So again, to lay this right on top of it, you got... You know, whatever you're rocking with in here, you know, whatever, you know, you got your little. So if you have an L box, you got your drill driver, your impact driver and one of your inserts, you lift it up and there's your screwdrivers. Great, great setup, man. I don't know. What, it's, it's a really good setup. Um, And they did improve these boxes and I really want to check out the new boxes, um, but these aren't bad. It's just, you know, once the tough system came out, because you got to remember the Makita and the and this Bosch, were, this was the first, right? Bosch was first to come out with a, you know, portable system. And I'm talking about the big five, you know, I'm not talking about like Festool and, but, you know, then Makita kind of came out and this and the Makita, very similar, almost identical. And I believe made by the same company. All right. And then a the tough system came out, right? And then the rigid came out and then the Milwaukee pack out came out. So, you know, just not as thick of uh, a plastic, you know, not as big, not as uh, many. Exactly. Just, you know, not built as durable as some of the other boxes, but you know, no one has issues. The, the, these are, these are fine boxes. You know, the biggest thing with them is they're kind of expensive. Now, they did drop in price a little bit, but, you know, when you can get the Milwaukee pack out for pretty much the same price and you're getting a bigger box, uh, you know, a more durable box, you got those little aluminum knick knack knick knack JT, what's up? Oh, they sold out 94. Yeah, they are. Zero Hero, I won't load. Are they brushless? Boss, could get a stubby versus the wall? Ah, that's no comparison. No comparison, uh, William. This is in another league compared to that DeWalt. The DeWalt is fine, guys, because to the price, it's $99. This is $179 bare tool. Now, obviously, I just did a deal yesterday where it was $130. But you can get three of those DeWalts for the price of one of these. All right? $300 versus $300, right? $99 times three is 300 bucks. You know, two seventy nine, whatever, add tax, um, but not bad for the money. And again, if you're using it with you know ten millimeter screws, eleven millimeter, eight millimeter, you know you might get close to that one fifty torque spec. Now, even though they say it's two hundred, I don't think you're getting anywhere near two hundred. Um, some guy saw the video. Nice guy, if he watches, you know. He's like, no, it definitely does 200 foot pounds, and I'll show you. And he did a video, and he was doing it on a Honda Civic. And he's like, yeah, man, look, 200 foot pounds, and it came off like gravy with the little 12 volt to wall. I'm like, you're doing it on a Honda Civic. Those are 100 foot pound. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, dude, you can tighten them up to 350. I bet you the DeWalt takes them off. Yeah. So, you know, but, oh, thank you. Tree boss. I appreciate that. And who, 43, Slayer, man. Hey, man, good to see you. I haven't seen you in a while. Slayer, man. I hope you're doing good, buddy. AT, not available. Yeah, it's not available. Chester, Mr. Food, man. Wow, how did, oh, Robert Bates, what are you doing? And I can't wait for Robert's gift. He's sending me a Boris Head sweatshirt, and I hope some salami and pepperoni. Thank you so much, um, 
Robert. And thank you again, um, Patrick S. You didn't need to do that. Chip shot. You're the man. Slayerman. Awesome. Guys, I appreciate it. Guys, keep your money. Please. You know, I get a lot of, of uh, messages on Instagram. Uh, there's no need to give, like, us people money. You know what I'm saying? You're giving these other channels. I, I uh, Sean gave me a screenshot the other day. Some the guy had 50, 100, 100, 25. I mean, the guy made, he must have made like $400. Guys, we do okay. Most of us are getting free tools, all right? You know, you see that little ad in the beginning. You know, you get a couple cents, uh, ad revenue. You know, I mean, you're not going to get rich, but keep your money. Spend it on your kid. Don't be giving it to these guys. These other guys are making a killing. Me too. I don't want your money. By you watching, that's important, all right? I don't have that membership thing and, you know, $5, you know, whatever they call them. Listen, peace and love. With peace and love, keep your money, guys. Don't be giving it away. And you know what? To be honest with you, the guys don't even get to keep most of it. Uh, YouTube or Google keep like 30, 35% of it. So, you know, you, you're giving me 20 bucks. I'm probably getting like $10 of it. Well, maybe $12, whatever the math is, $13. Tad Gates, what's up? Mr. Food. I appreciate that, John. Yeah, so anyway, guys, the Bosch, six-piece professional, six-piece screwdriver set. Guys, I'm telling you, when it comes available, and if it really is $21.99, like I paid, you will not find a better screwdriver set. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And, you know, someone uh, mentioned uh, every screwdriver, pretty much, all right? There's this one company that makes them in Japan, but most all of them, and I'll probably say 80% of them are made in China, guys. All right, you're not going to find a USA-made screwdriver. I mean, there is a couple companies that make them, but you're, you're spending, you know, not $20, all right, for a six-piece set with a bolster, a metal end cap, and all that. Um, I'm just looking where these are made. I do like to show that. But, yeah, Robert Bosch, Germany. All right, so they're designed, and this is on www.boschprofessional.com. I guess they have two different sites. I don't know. And, yep, made in China. But don't, you know, it ain't like a lot of other stuff that's made. This stuff is all made there, guys. All these screwdrivers, most of them. I mean, I think the wearers are made. I don't think the wearer. I don't think the wearers are made in in. um well, I know the Weehaws are Germany. These are made in um, the Czech Republic. Um, you know, besides these two companies, you know, most of your, you know, Milwaukee, they're going to be made in China, right? Your DeWalt. Again, you're paying $35 for this set, all right? Now, this is made in the Czech Republic, most likely. I think these are made in the Czech Republic. Some of the stuff uh, Wera makes is made in Germany, but most of it's made in the Czech Republic. But, you know, this is definitely not a better screwdriver than this Bosch. Now, yes, one is made in Czech Republic, one is made in China, but no way, no how is this Wera better than this. All right. And it's, you know, half the price. $40 compared to $20, all right? But, hey, you got to make that decision. Now, I did, you know, with what happened and what's going on and, you know, the state we're in, you know, I would, if there's a USA-made company that comes out and has pretty reasonable prices, you know, that's why I'm waiting so much for this Craftsman USA-made hand tools that we were promised, I think, two, three years ago. 
Now, I don't know if they're online yet, but they're definitely not in the store the last time I checked because we were looking for them. All right. Um, so once they come out, USA made stuff. All right. Hey, obviously, if it's the same hex bolster with a metal end cap, I would definitely pay $10 more because it's made in the USA. All right. But again, if you want this with a Weha sticker on it or a Wera, you know, name on it you're going to be paying around seven that and that that we set is a monster i have a couple videos on it if you want to check it out probably two years ago but it's an 80 dollars set all right even though these are made in china if they bust they're 20 dollars for a replacement right to get a whole new set now let's check and see the warranty on our Bosch professional. I don't see anything with a a warranty. A lot of um German writing on here. So th this yeah, you know, with the the Bosch professional stuff is it's this is all different languages on here. Um This is English. I don't see anything with a warranty on here. Um, I'm pretty sure you got some time, some type of warranty. Um, I don't know if it's a lifetime warranty, but you should have some type of warranty with these Bosch professional screwdrivers. But yeah, nice box, right? And the insert. So if you're interested, again, I'll keep my eye out, but they are sold out on Amazon right now. But thank you. My battery's going low. Patreons, I'll catch you later. But the Bosch six-piece professional screwdriver set with a bolster, anti-roll, blade-through handle, and a metal end cap with a really comfortable grip. I like them. 20 bucks with a l box insert i'll catch you guys on the flip